He said, blaming cholesterol for the heart condition is like blaming the paramedic for the car accident. Thank you. So Absolutely. if they have hypertension, instead of giving them a, a, t a pill for right. that hypertension, you're saying, all right, what's causing that? Absolutely. And, and, it, and it's a matter of identifying um, things that most doctors are looking at going, eh, it's really not a problem. Okay. Yeah, because it's not a problem to them because they're over here. Yes. This is the problem zone I'm looking at. And, and it's, it's just like hyperlipidemia, high cholesterol. Well, we're going to give them a statin to lower the cholesterol because, you know, elevated cholesterol causes strokes and heart attacks, which yeah. is the number one killer in America. Instead of going, well, what's the problem? What's causing that? So if you really dig deep, elevated cholesterol is an inflammatory marker. Which will lead us what's to... What's causing the inflammation? That's... Yeah, that's precisely well, that's the point. It. I saw a doctor who actually said this. He said, blaming cholesterol for the heart condition is like blaming the paramedic for the car accident. Thank you. Right, and, and that hit me. He's like, because what happens is, is every time you see a condition, you see a ton of cholesterol and you say, well, it's gotta be the cholesterol. He's like, if we showed up at every car accident and you saw a paramedic, you're like, well, paramedics are causing it. And he's like, no, it was the inflammation yeah. that caused the cholesterol. That, that is it in a nutshell.